Hi, Jill here again from Dutch Burrs in Saskatoon. Today we're going to be talking about how to get these little guys who like high humidity to survive in our homes. So how can we add these little plants into our homes and have them be successful like they would in their natural environment? We can make a pebble tray for these. And I'll show you a quick, easy way that you can have success in these plants. Step one is find a saucer. Now you can use an inexpensive plastic saucer, but I've got these nice um, ceramic saucers because they just look beautiful. If you want to protect your furniture, um, I would put a cork mat or something like that underneath it, um, but you can just set it like that. If you want to do individual plants, just sort of take some rocks. It's better if they're all similar sizes. We'll add the rocks onto that there. And then you would just simply set the plant on. So when you set the plant on, make sure it's nice and balanced. And then I'm just going to add water to the pebble tray. And what that's doing is the plant is not sitting in the water, but rather the water is just going to be evaporating around the plant. And this is the best way to keep your plants in their sort of natural environment with the humidity evaporating around them. Another way that you can have plants be more successful is by grouping plants together. Now this looks also really good as sort of styling different plants on a coffee table setting. So just again, take a bigger saucer, one that's going to fit about two or three plants, fill it up with rock, and then I'm just going to group my plants on here. I've got a couple ferns and a calthea. I group those plants on there. Add a little bit of water. And there you have it. We have a beautiful second piece for our um, coffee table. So thanks for watching. For more tips like this, come visit us on our website, www.dutchbirds.com, or subscribe to our YouTube channel.